the straight. Is he going to make it though? Into the hairpin as he goes right into there. He will make it stick as they now go into the first corner. Alex going back down the inside of Jacob into turn two. This going into the next right and just past the streak in the power. And then the Aston Martin as Alex is making overtake again. Put the straight and he does as well. He goes left into the Alex with the switch back of dreams and he's made it work too. Behind him now on the run up to him now trying to make the overtake and he has made it. Jake, wow! And they're now going down under the off the, off the bridge. Jacob gets back in front onto the straight. The lights out away we go here at the British Grand Prix at the Lace on International Airport circuit as Indian running down to turn one. We have Jacob taking the lead in front of Alex as they're now running down to turn two. Here we have Alex overtaking Jacob going into turn two and he makes it happen as well. That's Alex in front of Jacob here in front of turn three. Uh, maybe in turn four that is. They're inside of each other. Jacob's going to have the run on him going into the next corner. Alex is going to try and make the move literally up the inside. Going into the DRS straight. Who will have DRS here? Plus Jacob's going to try and make the move on him up the straight. And he does as well. And welcome to Abu Dhabi here at the Palm Harbor Circuit with 15 seconds left to go until the race starts and a 0% track water. We have a very exciting season finale to look forward to with Alex having surely won the championship here. And uh, we have it all to play for as the race is starting in 30 seconds. And we have a chat that will go crazy. And with a 10 to 12 lap race in store for us today. And a new championship winner if he can win this race. It's Alex versus Jacob. Jacob on pole position today. In Abu Dhabi, the season finale. It's triple points for the race. And it's double points for qualifying. Jacob won it with a 113.5 as you can see. So Jacob gets two points automatically. And if he wins this... He'll get eight as the light sequence is underway. Here in Abu Dhabi. One, two, three, four. And for the last time in the season, it's lights out. And away we go. Jacob and Alex get a very good start there off the line. We have a five, we have a ten lap race, sorry, to look forward to. As Alex is still in second place there, going through the first two corners. Jacob winning the race so far. Alex making the attempt there. Doesn't go through. Both of them on the medium tires, trying to go the entire length of the race, maybe, on these tires. Uh, as we have the next right-hander here to look forward to. Alex then getting very close behind Jacob. He's going to knock on that door and he's going to open it and he's going to get through Jacob with another attempt going down the straight now. Whoever gets DRS here will be very, very uh, fortunate. Jacob deploying the ERS and the DRS. Alex though is waiting for the next straight. Oh, there's an even longer one here where he's going to get the DRS and the ERS and he's definitely going to use it and he's going to try and make the overtake on the straight but it ends never mind it doesn't Alex pulling out and he gets in front of Jacob for like a split second before Jacob stays in front here going through the very awkward chicane section Jacob taking it well Alex even better though as Alex now making the look inside on Jacob trying to find a place where he can make that overtake obviously trying not to hit into the curb walls which are very exclusive, actually. Only on this track will you see that. As we now go through turn one there. Alex just behind Jacob. If Jacob can win this, he can maybe get just behind Alex. As Alex has got in front of Jacob into turn three. Or maybe even four. But uh, if Jacob can win this race and get all eight points. Then uh, he will get within two points of Alex. But uh, Alex, I believe, has locked out... His championship. And Jacob has gone into the wall. He's not lost the front wing though. Which is very lucky. And uh, he was within a second of him. But of Alex. And he's not anymore. With the Linguini right behind him. 
and a car that people would die for, he is going to try and hunt Alex and regain the lead of the race as Alex is on for a championship, or at least he was, as he has always he he won the championship uh, quite a while ago actually. As uh, Jacob now going through the next corner. Alex looks like he's spun there, but uh, he hasn't. And he's gone through there very well. Jacob then going a little bit off track. As uh, he's gaining time, on, actually, on Alex. Uh, but quite quickly as well, to be fair. As he's now within a second, it looks like, of Alex. As we now cross the main straight. And uh, go into the first corner. As the Linguini car there looks like he's getting lapped now, actually. As Alex hit the curb a little bit. Uh, sausage curb, sorry. And Jacob now oh. into the next corner, following Alex actually close behind. <laughs> Daniel, can you please just be a bit quiet? Thank you. Jacob going wide there as Alex with this championship win to look for. Going by the park benches on the side of the track. I, I go by the park but I don't know why there's park benches on the side of the track. Probably not the best idea in the world. Jacob there going very slow. As he has uh, got the DERS, sorry, going down the straight. Whether he needs to deploy it on this straight or the next is an executive decision that Jacob will have to be taking. As he's now got the DRS and he's got the ERS. And he is definitely going to be bearing down on Alex now. As they get into the left kink with the DRS zone ending at that line. Jacob still with ERS, they're going into the chicane. It, it's probably not even a chicane, it's probably more of an S than a chicane with three corners. But it doesn't matter as they go into the right-hander, through the next right-hander. And Ale Jacob, with a dream, is chasing Alex now, going into the first corner, lapping it now. What seems to be someone who's not even in the race. Uh, who, oh, actually, he might be. But, um, never mind. It's Jacob versus Alex now, going on to lap four of ten. As we now have Jacob going into the sharp right-hander. Down the main straight now. Into the right-hander. And Alex has lost it there going out of there. He's hit the curb and he's gone flying. As he may have lost a front wing. But it doesn't look like he has. So he's going to keep on trucking. And he's now got the DRS. And he will make the overtake on the Linguini. Hopefully. As he now goes into the left-hander. He will pick up more DRS. And a little bit of ERS there. As that's a very sharp breaking uh, point there. As he's now going under the bridge. And uh, Jacob there still in the lead of the race going down the left kink. He's lost the DRS. Alex, sorry, has lost the DRS, obviously, as we go by the DRS uh, off point. And he's very close to Jacob now. He's gone a little bit off and onto the sausage curve. But that traction on the Mercedes definitely helping him there. Not going flying. As Jacob now into the last corner going a little bit deep there. But obviously the track closes right in on you in that corner. And it's very awkward for drivers to get through that very well. As Jacob now into turn one. Through turn two now. Alex following close behind on lap five of ten. As Jacob now into the right hander. Alex very close behind there. Looks like he'll be looking up the inside or outside of Jacob in a minute. As they're going to go as now going through the right hander. Now through the double right hander. Alex very close behind. Looks like he's going to pick up DRS actually into the next straight as we now watch this all unfold and it's Alex within a second of Jacob with the ERS with the DRS looks like he's made the overtake but I think Jacob is still in front and he is as Alex has got the second DRS of the day. Jacob though with the ERS will he be staying in front? Yes, he will, as Alex has taken a lot of curb on the left there. And Alex has overtaken Jacob for the race lead. And now it's Jacob, he's back in front. Through the left hand to down the straight. Alex, though, looking for the overtake again. He's got the better line through there. Who will be able to get in front onto the main straight? And it's Alex who's overtaken Jacob down the straight into turn one. And it's very close here as Jacob came second in the Roblox race by 0.66 of a second. As someone's probably saying GG in chat. Jacob going a little bit wide here though. But we're only on lap five. And we've got five, uh, sorry, only on lap six. And we have got four laps to play for. And I've just got to keep reminding myself that we're on lap six before I forget. As Jacob's going very awkwardly wide through there. And uh, 
Alex, who's on the mediums, and I believe so is Jacob as well on the mediums, are going to have to pit in a minute as uh, the tire well will be starting to catch up to them. And uh, Jacob now through the mini hairpin, uh, through the sharp, sorry, left hander. Alex now down the straight, losing it a little bit on the front end. Jacob with a, oh God, Jacob with a dream, with a car right on his tail. Going into the long left hander. Alex though, finishing up the chicane now. Jacob also through the chicane. The Alpha Tower he's got it in front, but we're going to ignore that battle as Jacob's lost it. Onto the grass. <laughs> out of there and he's gone squiggling like a little worm as he's come into the pits and uh it looks like alex has done the same too as alex on lap six going on to lap seven now onto the mediums jacob from lap six onto lap seven and then he's moved a little bit and that'll reset his pit stop timer so he'll be there for a while as he's now put on the mediums and he's on his way out as we see jacob passing by there alex though out of the pits into turn two now. Jacob coming out of the pits now. That took ages. And he's now coming into la uh, turn one, sorry. Now into turn two. As uh, Alex then, a lot of time in front there on lap seven now with three laps left to play for, I believe. As it's now Jacob who has a want, who has a need, a need for speed as he is like a second faster than Alex probably on the second newer tires as he's now going through the DRS zone Alex there go on to the second DRS zone now go on to the back straight <laughs> Jacob who's finishing the first straight guys could you two please be quiet I'm recording and now it's Alex uh, uh, practice has started now but Jacob not very far behind Alex is now gaining gaining and gaining I repeat on Alex now getting into the long left hander going through now the chicane with the um, with, with the yeah well very high sausage curbs there as we're now staying with Jacob for the next while as I can't spectate anybody until practice is uh, well until they start practice going on to lap 8 now Jacob <laughs> on a mission yeah, trying to catch right up to Alex he's being Alex is being hunted here hunted to the death as Jacob the man on a mission going decently wide through that right hander sorry as uh, he's now oh god as we now ride on board with Jacob now for the first time in ages going down that straight as Alex as we can see him now going down the first DRS straight obviously Jacob and Alex both have DRS because it's practice and Jacob's dropping back a lot even though Jacob should be winning out on Alex <laughs> down the straights on lap eight, uh, on lap, um, yeah, on lap eight. This is as we're now watching Alex with DRS. Obviously, now the DRS zone is ending. Jacob now close behind with his DRS not being shown on my screen for some reason. Going through the chicane, Jacob is now hoping that Alex loses it or something, and he's now Alex now going through the right hander. <laughs> And if Jacob can win this race, this will be his second win ever. And if Alex can win this, this will be his ninth, if I am correct, eighth or ninth win this season. Uh, and his first ever championship win in the racing point on lap nine now. As it's Jacob close behind Alex now. Down one of the straights into the right-hander. Jacob following close behind Alex now as Alex coming into this right hander Jacob close behind now to the double right hander sorry and uh, Alex down the mini straight there onto the left kink just before the hard left uh, down by the beach it seems Jacob with DRS Alex with DRS now down the straight and Jacob now through the left hander very close behind Alex. Both of them now have DRS now onto the second straight. Technically onto the second back straight, I suppose. Alex seems like he's pulling away a little bit from Jacob. Obviously, he's pulling at the heart of Jacob as well. Um, on lap nine, as we're almost on the last lap of the race, we're now watching Alex on board here now through the double right-hander. Through the last corner, I 
as well, actually, as now Jacob also coming through the last corner. Six minutes until the race starts, and we're now watching a battle for the championship. Maybe, even, sorry, for the lead, maybe even the championship, but I'm not entirely sure on that one. As uh, Jacob now through the S is following very closely behind Alex on the last lap of this race. Jacob has lost it, though! Jacob's lost it, and his hopes of winning this race are dashed with it. And that is very unfortunate for him as Alex looks like he's going to take it home today. As we now watch Jacob close behind Alex and very wide there. Almost hitting the wall actually. Through the left hand. It's very unfortunate to see him spin out on that corner there. And maybe have his hopes of a win dashed from him. As we now go on to the last lap of this race. As Jacob now through this left hander. Down the DRS zone though. Alex far in front as it seems. But Jacob has caught up quite a lot. As everyone's now acting disinterested in this race. Going through the left hander. Through the next lefty. Jacob taking... Sorry, through the chicane actually. Jacob taking a lot of curb on the entrance there. Down the mini straight. Through the right hander. Now running with Alex as he comes through the last corner to win the World Drivers' Championship and the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix with it. What a race it has been from Alex and Jacob as we finish off the 10th lap of this race with a win from Alex. Very, very well done there. And it seems like we have a new world champion, and it's Alex. Congratulations, Alex, on your new World Drivers Championship. And well done, Jacob, for picking up those uh, three points on the way home as well. Congratulations, everyone. And uh, it seems like Alex here will be doing the celebratory donuts for winning the World Drivers Championship. Thank you all for an amazing season one of Ion, as Alex is now very laggily doing his donuts. Congratulations, and well done. And from all of us here in Driver Wars, we are all looking forward to the next season, season two of Driver Wars. With two new drivers, hopefully, and way better cars, and an all-new season. We all can't wait to see you for the first opening race of Season 2. Thank you very much. But before we go, we couldn't wait to see Alex's celebrations. As we now walk over to him in front of his garage, we watch him get out of his car and celebrate with his team and Alex is the new world champion <laughs> he'll be given the trophy in a little bit as we watch him and his car celebrate and it's a very special day for him and the team as they also pick up the constructors world championship well done racing point and Alex we can't wait to see you in season two Alex trying to defend his world championship Jacob trying to get his well done <laughs> and we'll see you in season two goodbye